Steel Authority of India Limited. Sale means different things to different people. To many, we are India's largest steel producer. To some, we are the bearers of a rich heritage. For others, we are a bridge to the future. Indeed, the thought of powering an emerging superpower humbles every employee at sale. भारत में नई सरकार बनने के बाद प्रधानमंत्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी जी के नेतृत्व में सरकार ने पारदर्शिता को प्राथमिकता दी है यह प्राथमिकता हमारी नीतियां पारदर्शिता और जनता में विश्वास बढ़ाने की दृष्टि से अत्यंत जरूरी लगती है प्रधानमंत्री जी का लगातार इस दिशा में आग्रह रहा है कि सरकार के माध्यम से प्रक्रियाओं में सरलता हो विवेक अधिकार कम से कम हो नीतियां पारदर्शी हो, जिससे कि बिना लाल फीताशाही के आम आदमी को सुविधा उपलब्ध कराई जाए आम आदमी की ज़रूरत पूरी की जा सके और सरकार की नीतियों का लाभ हर व्यक्ति तक आसानी से पहुंच सके इस्पात मंत्रालय भी प्रधानमंत्री जी की इस प्राथमिकता पर बहुत तेज़ी से काम कर रहा है स्टील अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया ने इस दिशा में अपने कदम बढ़ाए हैं मुझे पूरा विश्वास है कि सेल पारदर्शिता के साथ काम करेगा सेल निष्पक्षता के साथ काम करेगा सेल देश में विकास में योगदान देने की दृष्टि से काम करेगा और सेल की कार्यप्रणाली पूरी तरह विश्वसनीय होगी पारदर्शी होगी इससे हम जनता के बीच में जाकर ठीक प्रकार से सेल से जो अपेक्षा है उस अपेक्षा को पूरी कर सकेंगे मुझे इस अवसर पर आप सबको ये अनुरोध करना है कि जिस पारदर्शिता की ओर भारत सरकार जा रही है उस पारदर्शिता की क्रांति में आप सबका बराबर का योगदान हो जिससे कि देश के नवनिर्माण में और सेल के विकास में भी हम अपना ईमानदार योगदान कर सकें Touching the lives of millions, Sale has been incessantly working towards a robust mechanism of fair governance that can propel forward the company's exceptional credentials. Towards this objective, the Sale leadership has devised time-tested and reliable vigilance practices. A spirit of nationalism grips every Indian at the sight of tricolor fluttering atop India's first indigenously developed aircraft carrier, INS Vikram. Sail prides itself in powering the future dreams of the country by supplying special grade steel for prestigious projects like manufacturing of INS Vikram, the polar space launch vehicle, and indigenous development of submarine grade steel plates for the Indian Navy. Sail is one of the largest state-owned manufacturing companies in the world with a turnover of more than 50,000 crores, a strong workforce of 92,000 employees and five integrated steel plants punctuating the map of India. Hilai Steel Plant, Bokaro Steel Plant, Durgapur Steel Plant, Raurkela Steel Plant, Isco Steel Plant. True to the statement, there is a little bit of sale in everybody's life. Sale indeed touches the lives of millions and transforms the fortunes of its countrymen. Being such an integral part of the people of India makes it essential for Sale to have high levels of public accountability ensured through a robust preventive vigilance mechanism. Though the concept of preventive vigilance dates back to the Mauryan era, where Chanakya stressed on the necessary checks and balances in administration, in modern India, the thought of a vigilance mechanism and conducting administration in a transparent manner found fructification in the establishment of the Central Vigilance Commission in 1964. 
CBC formed as an apex body for prevention of corruption in central government institutions and public administration was vested with autonomy and insulated from external influences through enactment of the CBC Act in 2003. Adding to sales existing stringent norms with regards to vigilance, SAIL also constituted a competent vigilance team of highly qualified engineers and other senior officers in accordance with CVC's guidelines. For effective and good governance, the importance of preventive vigilance cannot but be overemphasized. With the advent of automation and digital systems, we are in a position to automate, analyze and prevent the happening of a misconduct. It is much better to prevent the misconduct rather than to deal with it after it has happened, whatever may be the punishment that may be given subsequently. Vigilance interventions at the preventive stage yield much better results than detection and punishment. The Central Vigilance Commission has therefore been laying emphasis on the preventive vigilance mechanisms and strengthening the systems of governance. The vigilance departments of the public sector undertakings and in particular the Steel Authority of India have been playing a very significant role in implementing the preventive vigilance initiatives of the Central Vigilance Commission. SAIL has been promoting transparency in its governance by several commendable methods such as switching to the tendering processes, transparency mechanisms, e-auctions, revising its manuals, etc. Good governance benefits everybody. I would therefore exhort one and all to be vigilant and protect the integrity of the systems. Constantly review and re-engineer such systems and deliver more efficient and effective services to the public. For benchmarking the effectiveness of vigilance administration in sale and to keep pushing the bar higher and higher, vigilance solemnly embraced the vision to establish and continually strive to improve quality management system to facilitate a conducive environment for enabling employees to work with integrity, impartiality and efficiency in a fair and transparent manner, upholding highest ethical standards to facilitate sale in becoming a world-class organization. Consequently, the objective and transparent vigilance management in sale has been hailed and acknowledged all around. An award of ISO 9001-2008 accreditation is a testimony to that. The role of vigilance in any organization is to complement the efforts of finance so as to plug in the leakages. Particularly in sale, the vigilance department has been proactive not only in establishing the new systems, but also in strengthening the uh, existing systems. First of all, SAIL has adopted the ERP for handling most of the activities in most of the plants and units, which helps us in handling the transactions systematically and to achieve the highest standard of governance. The sale has been following the practice of making payments on first come, first out basis so that the contractors, suppliers and vendors who have submitted their bills earlier, they get the payment on priority. Above all, sale has adopted the system of making e-payments to all its stakeholders including employees, contractors, suppliers, vendors, etc. I am sure in the time to come, the vigilance and finance departments of sale, they will work together more productively so as to improve the standards of governance further. To further promote ethical functioning in sale, the vigilance department undertakes several interventions that promote good governance. These are Transparent procurement system. Contracts which run into thousands of crores need to follow a transparent and fair tendering process. To minimize discretion and arrest mistakes in tendering, sale formulated transparent procedures as per CBC guidelines. The procedures were issued after consulting and brainstorming with all stakeholders to ensure that commercial decision-making is both prudent and quick. Laying down transparency guidelines, 
documents like standard bidding document and purchase and contract procedure have been formulated. These guidelines are periodically reviewed and updated to ensure adherence to latest CVC directives and also to gauge the effectiveness of the same. Presently, Sale conducts business worth crores on the e-platform, which offers enhanced transparency and faster processing over the traditional tendering methods. Steel manufacturing process is complex, and by the time finished product is received, a large quantity of secondary products with substantial market value are produced. Sale reviewed the process of selling of these valuable secondary products and initiated the switchover to selling through e-forward auction. In fact, on the advice of CVC, e-forward auction and e-reverse auction were introduced in sale as early as 2002. While e-forward auction proved to be customer friendly and helped in maximization of sales revenue, the process of e-reverse auction provided a platform which was fast, efficient, transparent and made cartelization of vendors difficult. The procurement prices of sale also climbed down since the adoption of e-reverse auction. Sale introduced e-commerce in terms of reverse auction in 2002. The success of this reverse auction led sale to introduce forward auction later on. At this moment, I am proud to say that sale is business in reverse auction and also forward auctions have gone off. In 2014 and 15, the reverse auction amount was to a tune of 4,800 crore rupees and in the forward auction, it was 2,900 crore rupees. Dedicated Tender Website Tendering often being the primary focus area of preventive vigilance, SALE has hosted a website, saletenders.co.in, dedicated exclusively for its tenders. While all open tenders of SALE are hosted on this website, it also disseminates a range of information on limited tenders, post-contract details of high-value contracts, tender guidelines, the existing vendors and vendor registration guidelines in a user-friendly format. This has attracted the interest of an ever-growing fraternity of reputed vendors in carrying out business with sale. My association with sale goes a long way back and we have been doing business with them for quite some time. But this time when we were asked to quote, uh, to take part in the online reverse auction, we appreciated the effort and we were explained in detail how to go about. Uh, we found the system much better than the old one and as we could work from the comfort of our offices and there was no need for us to go to their office, I must compliment Sale on introducing this new process which has uh, made us do business in a more transparent way. Integrity Pact To raise the bar of accountability and probity in high-value tenders, SAIL under the supervision of Central Vigilance Commission has adopted the mechanism of Integrity Pact. Under this mechanism, the entire process of tendering is scrutinized by independent external monitors, IEMs, who are persons of eminence with impeccable reputation and sound experience in the field of contracting. The independent external monitors interact with vendors and the principal to dispel apprehensions of any corrupt practices. Their advice to the management in maintaining the integrity of the tendering process has set benchmarks in transparency in sale. Knowledge sharing. Sale realized early on that the propagation of knowledge of various regulations and procedures and their correct interpretation is one of the cornerstones of preventive vigilance. With the objective of increasing vigilance awareness amongst employees, knowledge sharing sessions and workshops are conducted regularly at the plants and units. 
a total of 158 workshops involving 4006 participants were organized in the last year alone for enhancing employee awareness on Lokpal and Lokayukt Act 2013 purchase and contract procedure RTI Act conduct discipline and appeal rules systems and procedures followed in sale and other related topics the vigilance in-house journal inspiration is also being published periodically to reach out to more number of employees and to take the concept of vigilance to their doorstep sale vigilance also organizes knowledge sharing workshops for the captains of other PSUs of India on matters relating to e-commerce and governance as an active member of the Vigilance Study Circle of Delhi NCR, SAIL has earned the admiration and respect of all concerned for its thought-provoking seminars and workshops on e-commerce, good governance, ethics and fraud detection. Surveillance and Preemptive Checks Vigilance personnel of SAIL are alert to the various modes of fraud and manipulation and keep a close watch on transactions in vulnerable areas. Records are checked, transactions are scrutinized and questions are asked to ensure adherence to procedure. The alert vigilance wing of sale leverages the surprise element in preventive checks to the trepidation of unscrupulous elements. Such surprise checks in the receipt of high value raw materials like ferro alloys and coke have prevented supply of substandard material. Surprise checks in dispatch section ensure the delivery of correct quantity of sales steel of desired quality to the customers in a fair manner. In the last year alone, 3,200 periodic checks were conducted at different plants, which have led to a saving of about 20 crores. A substantial number of cases have also been taken up for intensive examination at different plants and units. Technological Intervention SAIL has effectively deployed various state-of-the-art surveillance equipments to ensure round-the-clock preventive interventions throughout the organization. The innovative positioning of CCTV cameras at vantage points has enabled vigilance to work as the eye in the sky of the management, which keeps a 24-7 close watch to eliminate malpractices. CCTV feed from way bridges, entry exit points, Dispatch sections and chemical laboratories have made surveillance for preventive vigilance effective in all aspects of plant functioning. SAIL has also installed provisions for storage of CCTV footage for future analysis, which acts as a major deterrent for unscrupulous activities. Various process parameters like the weight from way bridges, material composition from the XRF sampling machines, and the physical production data are captured in the auto systems arresting the scope of manipulation governance through ERP sale has moved ahead with enterprise resource planning which bears transparency accountability and speed as its hallmark through its innate provisions of checks and balances the ERP system has further strengthened the entire process of preventive vigilance throughout the organization. Vigilance monitors the ERP transactions to detect systemic flaws, if any, and aids in weaving solutions to tighten the system. Sale website sale.co.in is often the first online interface between sale and its stakeholders. Promoting preventive vigilance Several web-based features like whistleblower policy, provision for online lodging of complaints, status for CSR projects and expenditure incurred, status of bills submitted by vendors and many other features have been incorporated to improve governance and promote transparency. Transparency in Recruitment Sale is treasured with brilliant technocrats, managers and a large number of skilled workers who have been selected through a tough screening process. The process of selection of such a big scale can often be fraught with doubts and complaints. However, as a preventive measure, 
Sale has embraced the web platform for online issue of advertisements, receipt of applications and publication of results. The recruitment process, which has been accepted very well, is extremely transparent and efficient. To formalize the system of checks, Vigilance has played an instrumental role in formulation of sales recruitment manual. सेल में प्रिवेंटिव विजिलेंस के विभिन्न अवयवों को लागू करने का अधिकतम प्रयास किया गया है इनमें नियमों विनियमों के जरिए डिस्क्रिप्शनरी पावर्स को सीमित करना ईआरपी, वेबसाइट का उपयोग ई प्रोक्योरमेंट जिसमें ई ऑप्शन भी सम्मिलित है और नियुक्तियों में पारदर्शिता सम्मिलित हैं इन सब के अतिरिक्त हमारी पूरे देश में विजिलेंस की तेरह इकाइयाँ हैं इन इकाइयों में सिस्टम इम्प्रूवमेंट प्रोजेक्ट्स हर वर्ष लिए जाते हैं सरप्राइज चेक्स होते हैं बड़ी परियोजनाएँ जो हैं उनका इंटेंसिव एग्जामिनेशन होता है जो कि सीवीसी के गाइडलाइंस के तहत होता है और जो क्रय विक्रय अधिक मूल्य के हैं उनकी फाइल्स क्रूटनी होती है इन सब के अतिरिक्त हम अधिकतम प्रयास करते हैं कि प्रिवेंटिव विजिलेंस तथा विजिलेंस के अन्य आयामों के प्रति अधिक से अधिक जागरूकता पूरे ऑर्गेनाइजेशन में फैले और उसके लिए विभिन्न ट्रेनिंग सेशन्स तथा विभिन्न अवेयरनेस सेशन्स किए जाते हैं सेल टू वर्ड्स एंड एथिकल फ्यूचर Ethical lapses always tend to snowball. Once someone sees others breaking rules, he may believe it is okay to do so. But Sale and Visions training the impressionable minds of children from a very young age on ethical practices and developing values which foster honesty and secularism, nurture patriotism, infuse compassion and generate respect through activities like plays, community activities, poster drawings etc sales efforts are result of a rich legacy of good governance evolved over years of toil in heat and dust and a continuous pursuit for excellence in all the spheres of activity with ethics being the core reverberating value at the end the ultimate objective is always to ensure the universal rule of satyamev jayate